Good morning. Welcome to the Cool Kids Podcast, Episode Ten. I am your host, Isabella Chavez, and today I'll talk. I'll be talking about singing. Um, singing is about showing who you are. Other singers follow their dreams, so now you can. Trying your best. Trying your best is about trying the hardest you can, and you can never give up. Be clear, because you want people to understand what you are saying and know what you uh, understand what you are saying. Be loud and proud. I love singing because it makes me happy. Um, now I'm going to be interviewing Miss James. Hello, Miss James. Hi, Isabella. I'm so happy to be on your podcast. Um, me too. Um, what's, why did you make rapping songs? Well, the way I started writing rap songs, as you know, I like to call myself the teacher rapping queen. Yeah. Is because ever since I was really little, I like to write poems. And I would write a poem for my parents for their birthday. I'd write it for holidays. I'd write them for Christmas. And eventually, I started to turn my poems into rap songs. Cool. Um, and that's how I started rapping. Yeah. That's cool, Miss James. Thanks. What's your favorite rapping song you ever made? Ooh, that's a hard question. I've made so many. I think my two favorite rap songs I ever wrote was one from last year um, that I called 50 Cent. And um, 50 Cent's actually a real rapper. But I wrote 50 Cent um, about money. So I pretended that I was a quarter, and Miss Cirillo pretended that she was a quarter, and together we made 50 Cent, and we wrapped, and we wrapped a song. And my other one is called The Teacher Rapping Queen that, that I played in the beginning of the school year, talking about all the exciting things that we were going to do in first grade for that year. Wow, that's awesome. I really like listening to your songs, too. Thank you for being in my podcast, Miss James. Thank you for having me. Bye. Bye. Now I'll be interviewing Arushi. Hi, Arushi. Hi, Isabella. I have a question for you. What is your favorite song? Well, my favorite song is called Cheerleader. That's great. I like that song, too. Um, I have a question for you, too. What? Um, what do you like most about singing? I like singing because it's very compassionate. It makes me get ready for this day to start. So, thanks. Bye. Bye. Now, listen to the cool interview I had with Nick Ken. Hello? Hello. Boys and girls, one, two, three. Hi. 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 How are you guys doing? We're doing great. How are you doing? I'm doing really well. It's so awesome. So cool. Well, um, I guess this came about because one of our students, Isabella, is doing a podcast. Are you there? Oh, sorry. Our, uh, our video messed up. Huh. Hold on. It's like a poor connection. All right. I guess it will resume when the connection is better. We can still hear you, though? Yeah, I can still hear you, too. Okay. So one of our students, Isabella, is doing a podcast on music. So she was super excited to ask you a few questions. Oh, cool. Absolutely. Thank you so much for taking the time to answer them. <laughs> no problem at all. All right, Isabella, go ahead. Um, the first question is, what did you want to be when you were in first grade? Uh, in first grade, I wanted to be a fireman. <laughs> oh, wow, a fireman. Anybody here want to be a fireman? Yeah, Risha. Oh, sorry, Risha wants to be a fireman. I'll be a policeman. Policeman? Cool. Okay. All right, Isabella. <laughs> what advice do you have for me because I want to be a singer? Oh, I would say keep singing. I mean, that's where it starts. I mean, every, when you say you want to be a singer, all you got to do is sing, and you're a singer. So, <laughs> as far as you know, I'm just singing. <laughs> keep singing. Um, okay. Um, okay. How did you get inspired to write a song with Indian beats? Uh, I always loved the culture of India and, and uh, just 
Bollywood, Punjabi, and Hindi. So, I, and I, I actually had the opportunity to visit uh, Mumbai. So that that idea just it was always wanting to connect with the culture. And a lot of friends that I had from the Hindi culture uh, introduced me to. Nice. Okay. Um, <laughs> what does happiness mean to you? Happiness means uh, to wake up each day and honestly do whatever is positive. You know, uh, putting smiles on other people's faces. Like happiness is just the freedom to to do whatever you want to do and and. and Express yourself. Okay. Um. <laughs> These are tough questions. <laughs> You're doing a great job answering them. <laughs> Do you have any favorite children's book from when you were little or one that you read to your kids? Absolutely. I'm a huge fan of an author by the name of Shel Silverstein. Even when I was in the first grade, uh, I was introduced to these really cool poetry books. Uh, light, where, light in the uh, attic. The light in the attic, where the <laughs> sidewalk ends, the giving tree. Those are all our favorite books. Yeah, and and he's still my favorite author. And I even have, uh, I was inspired by his book of poetry so much that I wrote a book of poetry uh, that's very similar, called Neon Aliens Ate My Homework. <laughs> 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 it's funny. Okay. What's the coolest place you ever traveled to and why? Uh, one of the coolest places I ever traveled to would definitely have to be India. Uh, getting to go to Bombay and the music video for Hold On was shot there too. So uh, it, was, it was really cool just to see, you know, all the different places in India. Has anyone here ever been to Mumbai or Bombay? Yeah? So cool. Wow. Wow, your families were born in the coolest place he's ever been to. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Okay, um, what kind of things did you experience in experience in Mumbai and Bombay? Uh, I got to go to uh, this cool place called Elephant Island where there was a bunch of monkeys all over the place. Uh, you want to statues. I, I saw that like that was a place was really cool. Um, what else did I go? Do you, I got, do you like Indian food? I do. I got a, a chance to experience a lot of cool like Indian food. Like I got to go to the beach while I was out there. That What's was really cool. Um, do you do you eat spicy food? I do. I love spicy. Food. Oh, oh James spicy food. likes Daddy, spicy food. I love spicy food. <laughs> Miss Cirillo doesn't like spicy food. I like spicy I food. <laughs> I like spicy food. I have one more question. What's your favorite song? Uh, uh, hold on, of course. <laughs> hold on. We, well, we had a great time dancing to your song. That was awesome. And we're so, we're so happy that you represented the Indian culture because not many songs out there that, you know, are in, Indian. you know, music nowadays have that. So it got us really excited because not... Uh, I don't know what the percentage is. It's a very high percentage of um, people in Edison um, are from the Indian culture. So we were we were really happy. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, we got to keep listening to it. I keep sharing that the, the video that you guys made. And every time someone sees it, they, they love it. So uh, I, I thank you guys so much. For being we're, we're watching it. We're watching all the views. The class is enjoying uh, um, seeing people, seeing the views go up. <laughs> they think they're famous now. I have one more question. Okay, last question. You guys, you guys okay. are famous now. <laughs> okay. I have one more question, the last one. Okay. One what's, what's your favorite activity? Oh, wow. My favorite activity? Great question. Probably writing. I love writing. I mean, I love reading. Oh, I love reading. Oh, I, like I like it, too. Because, like, you writing get a lot of things from writing. You learn a lot. Shh, hold on. And you learn a lot That's from cool. it. Uh, well, boys and girls, what do we say? Thank you so much. That was so awesome. Cool talking to you guys. It was <laughs> such an amazing time talking to you. Thank you so much. Adios. Thanks. Bye.